this video intended for educational purposes. Arr, welcome back to another Minecraft 1.8 snapshot, mateys. I be Adam, aka Swimming Bird, the captain of this here video. And, uh, <coughs> I've got something very special to show you guys today. It is only possible in 1.8. We are in 14W5B, one of the newest 1.8 snapshots. This is a moving boat, believe it or not, made by Mr. Cheese on Reddit with the schematic for the boat by Zeltham. And if I step on this little pressure plate here on the bow, we will start sailing. And here we go. We're going across the waters. And if you listen close, ah, the crashing waves off the port side and some particles flying up. It's, uh, it's pretty cool. And it's actually not that complicated. Surprisingly, it is thanks to a few new features in 1.8. I'm going to hit this switch here, and you see we went hard to starboard, and we can also do that, go to port there, and uh, it flips the boat around so we can go different directions. Sometimes there's a little bit of artifacting, but it actually goes away very quickly. And if any entities are within this boat, such as me, another player, any pigs or you know mobs like that, they will actually sail along with us, which is really cool. And I've got some footage here. Here's some uh, some squid sailing along with me, which is really cool. I like that the squid actually like go with you and ride along with the boat. That's pretty awesome. But I'm gonna go over here and we'll go into how this works. Now I've hit land, but we actually stopped. So there was an earlier version of this ship that actually tore through a bunch of land, but this one is pretty smart. It detects when you're going to hit land and it stops the boat. So the first thing, a little bit of magic that allows us to work, we've got these four boats here. You can hide these a little better, but they're down here lit up so that no mobs and stuff get on them. But these are the four directions. So this uses the new 1.8 clone command so we can clone these blocks. So every time I move, it's actually cloning one of those ships. So if I was to break a board here and then get going, it will actually repair because it's using a fresh version. So you, so you don't have to worry about your ship getting damaged. But as we go on, there are a few command blocks inside the ship itself, though, that work, and I'll show you them in a second. Now, the first here, I will bust open the floor to show you guys. So there's four in the front. There's only about 12 of these or so total, so it's pretty simple. There's four in the front. These guys detect whether or not there's a block in front of the ship, and if there is, it, it won't clone it, but if there isn't, it'll keep going through the water. Then if that is successful, it sends a signal through a comparator, and we have some cool commands here that'll... Uh, pop in some splash effects we've got some crazy there's the cloning and then there's the ambient sounds and stuff and if you push one of these side ones it actually makes a command block minecart stack pop in and quickly kill itself but then that'll clone to the other direction so it helps you orient the ship but yeah it's a handful of commands and if you want to test this out Mr. Cheese has a world download that you can download. I'll link to his Reddit thread to check it out. I, I advise you do and get some friends and play around with this because this is really awesome. I'm just excited that we finally have a lot of this stuff in Vanilla Minecraft that we can play around with these sorts of things. And normally we could never do something like this, but with some of these new commands you can make all these effects and make it really cool with sounds and particles and... Yeah, all this stuff just comes together to make this a really cool little way to get around. And you could even make uh, a bulldozer with this. I could see someone just bulldozing through land with this type of idea. And right now, there there's kind of a limit on how many blocks can be cloned. It's like 5,000 or so, and this is like 4,000 or so blocks. But if you used multiple, you know, little bits of these, it would be a little more complicated, but you could still make bigger things go around. Like, I would love to see someone make like a giant robot or something, have that stomping around, breaking through stuff. The possibilities seem to be pretty endless now that we have some of these things in the game. So anyways, thank you guys for watching. Please go try this out. This is so cool. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed this. Thank you, Mr. Cheese, for building this. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoy. So I'll see you next time for some more Minecraft. Uh, please don't begrudge my horrible pirate accent. <laughs> Goodbye, guys. And if I want to turn my ship, just walk over here and bang, we're hard to port. This one goes to starboard. It will uh, start... <laughs>